Well, pumpkin pie might be the start of any Thanksgiving dinner, but that doesn't mean you have to deter from that holiday eating diet, you know, that you have. Not, not 100% at least family <laughs> wellness, healthy cooking instructor Nicole Dew is with us to talk about a really good pumpkin applesauce muffin recipe. Great. Welcome back to the show. Thank you for Yay. having me. They look delicious. <clears throat> I'm glad They're you little over here. <laughs> <laughs> I was saying, and you weren't in here, I was like, oh, she made the little tiny ones. Can you hold one up, Chris, so that people can see? I yes. love that you made them in your little mini muffin maker. Yeah, and that's a great way for portion control, too, because those muffins are less than 100 calories a piece. Oh. So you just pop one or maybe two when you have a nice little snack there. So I love that. Perfect. Yeah. You can also make it in the bread pan today, which we also will do, oh. or just Okay. in regular muffin size as well so awesome all right let's get started so I'm going to show you how to make this healthier today because we are using applesauce instead of oil so that's going to cut a lot of the fat cal calories out of the the dish so we'll start with you Chris we're doing all of our wet ingredients here so we okay. have applesauce like I said to sub for the oil now we have a half a cup of honey instead of sugar we're just using a more natural source of sugar nice mm -hmm. we have two eggs and then a cup of pumpkin. Now this pumpkin is not the the app or the pumpkin pie filling that you that you can find in the store. This is just plain pumpkin. When you when you're at the store, you see on the label it just says pumpkin, and that's pumpkin. it. Pumpkin. No sugar, no flavors, no nothing. Okay. So that's what you want to look for is right. to make sure that you're not buying the pie filling you want because that's going to add even more sugar to exactly. the recipe. Exactly. Yeah, and, it, and a couple of eggs. Couple of eggs. Yep. Okay. Couple of eggs. I wanted you to crack it one-handed and be like, Rapa. Okay, all right. <laughs> all right, let's see it. Yeah. Woo! He's got those cooking skills. He learned the knife skills That's the other awesome. day, and now he he's cracking eggs blender. with one hand. Oh, okay. And blend that up, and then while he's doing that, Christy will go ahead and with the dry ingredients Okay. Here. So we have our flour, and this is a whole wheat white flour. He's oh, okay. He's nervous <laughs> to blend. You're fine. Okay, good. <laughs> All right, you may want to hold it. Okay. <laughs> Don't blend your thumb. Uh, right. Whoa. Yeah, this, this is fine. How's that? Am All I right, good? that looks good. That looks good. Okay. <laughs> we'll get going on our dry ingredients here. So we have a whole wheat white flour. Okay. So this is something kind of new, I think. So you get the whole grain um, goodness of whole wheat, but it, it's a lighter color. So t sometimes that is, mm -hmm. is a little bit more pleasing, especially t for kids. All right, then we have our cinnamon, two tablespoons of cinnamon. We have baking powder, baking soda, and salt. So just your basic um, quick bread recipe. Yeah. Nice. And just mix it up. And am I yep. adding it to his or? I'm going to put it in yours. Oh, OK. You're pouring it in. Yep. All right, that's awesome. good. Go ahead and mix that up. When you want a spatula, Larson, or are you good? No, I got it. Okay. This slotted spoon is working perfectly. <laughs> so when you're mixing a quick bread, you want to make sure that you just um, blend it until it's all incorporated. You don't want to over blend. Okay. Because then you get the peaks on your muffins. Have you and ever you done don't that? Want those? Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Almost every time I've made muffins. So now you know you're over mixing the batter. Just they're until. still edible with the peaks on there. Yeah. Oh yeah. For sure. <laughs> It just probably, I'm sure, then to people who know that they aren't supposed to be there are like, oh, Christy. Exactly. You made those wrong, but that's all right. So, okay. while you're doing that, I'm going to do, we have a nice little crumble topping that just kind of makes it extra special. Oh, I love that. So Yay. we have brown sugar, some oats, just a tablespoon of flour to hold it all together, and then we have a little bit of butter. You can use coconut oil if you want. Blend so that should I pour together. mine in? Yes, Because yep, I'm ready. Ahead. Okay. And fill that up. With my slotted spoon. Whoops. <laughs> it works. Yeah. It works. Sometimes so, that's all that's clean in the house, too. Exactly. <laughs> that's right. If you're one of me, sits in the dishwasher for a while, forgetting to run it. Come on, Jaren, step up your game. <laughs> that was the, the other day, that was my fault. I took out something and I thought it was clean and it was still dirty and I forgot to press start on the dishwasher. Whoops. Okay. All right, so once we have that in the pan, we just take our crumble topping and sprinkle that on top. Mmm. I know. That looks so good. And you just know it's going to get that nice caramely crunch, crunch on yes. the top. Yes. yes. And that's it. Yeah, so we pop that in the oven. If you're making a loaf, it's going to take about 45 to 50 minutes, maybe even a little bit longer. You want to check it 
with the toothpick test. Mm -hmm. The mini muffins you can do in just about 12 minutes. Let's taste test those. I agree. Any uh, classes coming up you want to tell us about? Or? Yes, we have lots of great kids classes coming up before Christmas. We're going to be making Santa pancakes with the kids. Nice. We're also going to be, this tomorrow actually, we're doing boga, which is we're making bread and doing yoga. So, oh. well. <laughs> I love that. These are really good. Well, the bread um, bakes, the kids will be doing yoga, and then, and so they'll be learning two skills in one, so. Fun. Yeah. And so they can get their kids signed up online, or adults, there's adult classes too. Adult classes, yes, yes. So, mm. check out very, familywellnessfargo.org, very and come see us. Yeah, and you can get the recipe also up on our website, mdtoday.tv. Thank you for the muffins. You're welcome. Mmm, very good. We'll have more to come here on North Dakota today in a little bit.